Hello and Namaskar to everyone. My, my name is Sandeep Sanak from Belgaum District. I am a, a, a former organizing secretary for the Bharati Shikshan Mandal, which is working for the Bharatiyata in uh, education and uh, also working in Nikhil uh, Policy Foundations for Korea, working with Nikhil Ji. Right now I am having a responsibility in Dikki, that is the Dalit Indian Chamber of Commerce for Industry. Uh, as a Karnataka state co uh, It's very, uh, very glad to have uh, uh, be here in this conference for the G20, C20, Civil 20. Uh, yesterday we had been in a group discussions for the youth and democracy. What I think is that uh, increasing participation of youth in a democracy is the way yesterday I represented uh, like uh, in the Gram Panchayat to the uh, to the urban level and uh, from the uh, uh, rural area uh, to the parliamentation uh, parliament and uh, politics. Uh, if part, democracy is not only in the politics, democracy is in the completely in the whole daily life activities. Youth should participate uh, in uh, politics also. And uh, you should participate in uh, all sectors of uh, um, economical and social entrepreneurship like agriculture, like social entrepreneurship, like uh, uh, hospitality, like sanitation and all. But what is the problem now? We see that there is a opportunity, lack of opportunity. Um, uh, uh, lack of opportunity in the Gram Panchayat, we see that only politicians are, uh, uh, they take the decisions. But uh, people, youth don't know in the uh, rural area that there is a facility of uh, in municipal and gram panchayat of different different subcommittees where a non representative can also participate. Like uh, different interests uh, minded uh, youths, like someone is an agriculturist and he is interested for the thinking and he has good ideas about the agriculture of their particular area and their village. So he wants to take some decisions, collective decisions. Uh, and want to put his ideas into the Gram Panjata or Munshi Party Committee, subcommittees, so that that whole uh, collective decisions will be taken and it will, it will be implemented. But it lacks opportunity. He, then, he or she didn't get that opportunity. Same way in the persons who uh, the youth wants to start an entrepreneurship new business, he don't get the opportunity when he go to the bank uh, because of uh, awareness, less awareness about the policies like we have Stand Up India, Start Up India, we have uh, uh, Pradhan Mantri Employment Guarantee Policy and all many different kind uh, uh, Mudra Yojana is there. But this, these youth don't get the opportunity uh, to get the loan and start the new startup or the entrepreneurships. It's because of the aware, less awareness and the less opportunity. So what we have to do is that when, how can we, uh, this is also a, a way of democracy, uh, how can we increase it? It is uh, just to be the simple way I think is that um, uh, bringing full of awareness, complete awareness in the Gram Panjat and Munshi Party and then giving training to the trainings to the uh, all sectors of uh, 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 youths, uh, depending upon the interest, they will come to the and participate in the Gram uh, Panjat uh, and Municipality and uh, giving them EDP program like employment development programs are there and uh, giving uh, uh, helping them to implement collectively so through that they will think that ha huh, it is my interested field and i should participate so and i have to take it uh, decisions uh, on the behalf of my whole this uh, whatever sector i am working for my village and for my society and for my district and for my other nations so every youth will think in their perspective interested field and they will participate so in this way we will we can increase the youth's participations in our democracy and then only the democracy would be established that is what we think is the dharma sthapana then only the dharma sthapana of democracy can be possible when all sectors of the field uh, youth uh, working in that field uh, will be given the opportunity and the information thank you